Room and pillar is a common mining method for mining ore bodies with a dip less than 50 degrees. There are different variations of the method depending on rock conditions and the dip and thickness of the ore body. When mining the ore, a grid system of open rooms, together with a system of pillars to support the overhead rock mass, is created. The mining sequence can be optimized to accommodate rock conditions and ventilation demands. The ore is usually mined out using the same drill and blast technique as in conventional drifting, where the drift becomes the room between the pillars. The process itself holds a number of sequential operations, where the number of activities varies depending on ground conditions and design criteria. The key to success in room and pillar mining is to establish the optimum sizes of the rooms and the pillars to recover the maximum amount of ore and leave the smallest possible pillars behind without compromising safety. Room sizes and pillar dimensions are based on rock conditions and predicted rock stress changes that may occur when mining. To ensure safety in areas with a larger roof span, rock reinforcement such as cable bolts are sometimes required in addition to rock bolts. Accurate drilling and good blasting practice minimize overbreak and blast damages in the pillars. This plays an important role to keep the strength in the pillars and therefore preventing pillar failure. As the ore is being mined out, roadways for ore transport and infrastructure are created inside the production area. Working at several production points enables efficient use of equipment. Various transportation methods can be used for transporting ore to surface. A well-planned room and pillar mine is flexible to changing commodity prices on the market and can quickly respond to changing market conditions. Room and pillar is a productive and flexible mining method that comes with a certain degree of ore loss for both small and large-scale operations.